surface. It looks like your basic anatomy display, but there is a lot more to this than meets the eye. Yeah, the Body Worlds and Cycle of Life exhibit brings 15 real human bodies to Kansas City, something many find controversial. Joel Nichols is live at Union Station with more on this. Joel, good morning. Good morning. I'm standing here with Dr. Angelina Wally, who is uh, the curator of this exhibit. And let's just talk right off the top about the fact that some people may be a little uncomfortable with the idea of these bodies being displayed, but this, these are donated. These are people who wanted to examine the cycle of life through their own life. Exactly. It's absolutely essential for us that everyone has consented to be on public display. Right. And so all specimens here have been donated to our body donation program that we initiated already back in the 1980s in Germany. And this is the process is called plastination? Exactly. That is a process that my husband, Gunther von Hagens, invented already back in the 1977 and right. devoted his entire life to make it what it is today. And it is actually a vacuum process that allows us to exchange a tissue water against a polymer like silicone rubber or epoxy resin. And that runs as a specimen dry, orderless. We can pose it in very beautiful, aesthetic ways. Right. And they last more or less forever. And what do we learn by taking the walk through this exhibit? What do you hope we are learning about our lives and about the world in general? Well, you have your body with you all your life, but as a layperson, you never really see and understand what's inside you. And right. this is what Body Worlds is about. It allows you really to have a unique opportunity to find out about your inner self and also to reflect about your inner self. By looking at these wonderful specimens, it becomes clear that your body is not just a divine gift or bounty of nature. It is your lifelong responsibility and whatever you do it matters and this is what as a curator I would want people to take away what a wonderful treasure they have inside themselves. It is an amazing uh, exhibition and as far as children are concerned it says right in the uh, material it's really up to you what you think your your child can or cannot uh, see or handle and then be prepared to talk about it because that's really what this should do is uh, create a lot of conversation and discussion. Back to you.